If you followed my content for a while, you will know how big of a fan that I am of Bear Grylls and that it's a mission of mine to climb Mount Everest on my 46th birthday. You're probably thinking that, Ollie, look, you're the go-to guy for health, for entrepreneurs all around the world. Why are you telling me about your goal of climbing Mount Everest? Well, over here in the UK, we've got the Running Wild series with Bear Grylls. And in the US series, there's loads of American actors and some real big names on there. But over here recently, we had the Warwick Davis special. The actor from Star Wars, from Willow, from Harry Potter and many other amazing films. And he's overcome a lot in his life just from being a dwarf. And he's there talking about all the things he's overcome. He's there with the big expert, Bear Grylls. Loads of other experts filming, safety teams around. And this has got a lot to do with your fat loss, with your health, with your progression, with getting accountable. Because a lot of people are scared. Scared to take that step over the edge. Scared to take that step where they gain and build momentum. There's one scene in particular where Warwick has this zip line. All being clipped in, knows he is safe knows he is going to get to the other side of the ridge where Bear is standing waiting for him. Bear is calling out, come on Warwick, let's go. Come on Warwick, let's go. And a lot of people do this, especially in the entrepreneurial world, because they like to be the person in charge. It's hard to hand your health over to someone else to make you accountable. I get it. I totally get it. But that expert has already gone over. That expert has shown you the way of what to do. You have paid that expert and you've invested. You know you need to change. You know you need to take that step. However, it's hard to do so. You know that step creates another step. You know that step allows you to build momentum. So we have Warwick on the edge of a cliff, clipped into the zip wire, and he's thinking, oh God, I can't do this. I can't do this. I can't do this. Just like a lot of entrepreneurs will tell themselves about their health. Will tell themselves that I cannot get healthy and eat amazing food without sacrifice. I have to do these balls to the walls workouts, which I haven't got time for. And I'm not going to sacrifice my relationships even more to get healthy. When in fact, your relationships have already suffered a hell of a lot because of the hustle and grind you've put into your work day in, day out. Your sex life is practically none because you've failed to take that first step. You're clipped in and you need to move. And a lot of people will attempt to make this first step just like Warwick did. Then he makes that step. He starts going, puts his hands down on the floor and he just grabs hold and he just hold him for dear life, just grabbing, hold and hold and hold. Grabs onto some plants, onto some sticks, onto some trees, onto some branches. And he's there. He took that step. He was starting to build momentum and now he has stopped himself. The procrastination has set in. He's making it worse and worse. When if it had just let go, Follow the process, trust the person who was making him accountable, trust the person that showed him the way, he would have built momentum. He would have got really far over that ridge, almost to the other side where Bear was waiting to pull him to his destination, to get him there in one swoop. But no, what happened? Warwick took that step, then he stopped himself, lost momentum had to build up the courage again. Build up the courage for a second time for the biggest moment of his life when it comes to basically growing some balls. And he goes across the ridge after this plant has just ripped out of the ground. And then he gets stuck in the middle, has to climb and pull himself across. 
and he is scared, so scared. Because he started once, built momentum, stopped. Started again, built momentum and stopped. When if he had just done it in the first place, he would have got so far across and that is the same thing with your health. If you trust the process, if you stop stopping, you will have to stop starting. It is that simple. Find a way of getting yourself accountable. Find someone you trust in to help you get in there. See that they can get you there. Create a plan. Take the step and don't look back. It really can be that simple. Especially when you're working with the go-to guy for entrepreneurs like yourself. Especially when that plan is tailored by me specifically for you on a one-to-one -one basis. Now, if you don't want to be like Warwick, if you don't want to be that person that's grabbing onto the edge for dear life, the person that takes a step and then stops, disconnects with the ground, flies a little bit and then stops again and has to pull himself painstakingly every single inch of the way, you don't want to be that person, get in touch with me. Get in touch with me right now. We will book in a call and let's get your health, your accountability, your optimization, your entire life in check. I look forward to speaking to you.